Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Today I have one nice laptop with me. Model is Lenovo Yoga 730-30 IWL. As per the customer, the laptop is not turning on at all. So I think it is a no power situation. The keyboard and trackpad area also looks fine. And this one i7 8 generation laptop. I cannot see any physical damage or liquid damage also. So I am going to connect the charger. Let's see what's going on. If you can see charging LED is there but it is not turning on. Power button is in the other side. Let's try. Also not turning on. I am going to check with my Type-C adapter so we can get an idea about what is going on inside exactly. Using this adapter we can see the voltage and the current that laptop takes in at the moment. Let's see. The adapter is turning on if you can see the screen clearly. Uh, let me zoom it for you. All right, now you can see the adapter. So this one takes only five volts, which means, oh, I think cable got loose. Yeah, it takes only five volts, which means it is uh, not communicating properly with the charger. Let me see the port also. ports looks fine actually there is no damage yeah ports looking okay you can see also I think there is a faulty PD controller inside the laptop anyway it's we will have to open the laptop and check about that we'll see okay it is done board actually looks fine let me zoom in for you yeah the board looks like uh, no one has touched before so here we can see uh, this two type C ports and I think this is the PD controller we will have to see the model number to confirm that I think it is the time to get the microscope to the work let's see Okay, here we can see TPS65988. This is the PD controller. I think this has to do something with our issue with the laptop.
I am checking whether we have any physical damage around the area around the PD controller and its components looks fine actually there is no physical damage ok let's check the components around the PDIC that way we can find out if anything like a small maybe capacitor or something is faulty or not ok I'm gonna check the continuity a multimeter in diode mode now ok I'm going to check these capacitors <coughs> whether they are shorted to ground or not Oh, that is ground ok that's all ok ok this, this looks short yeah, it is short ok let's check the other ones also ok this looks ok yeah that one also ok and this one is fully shorted I am gonna try and find the pin number let's see where it goes ok okay it is a pin number 8 I'm gonna try to find the schematic sheet for this laptop so we can find out the values of this capacitor okay I found the same schematic diagram for this laptop and this is the PD controller we are talking about now and the pin number 8 we can see here oh it is VBUS 1 I think this is the capacitor that we are talking about it's 25 volt ok so this is in VBUS line and it is shorted to ground that's why charger is rejecting it so you can see it clear right ok now I'm going to take the board out and remove this capacitor ok the board is out I cannot see any damage like physical damage all looks fine ports also ok ok let's remove the capacitor then I will check quick to one more time yeah it is short
okay I just disconnected the capacitor from the board so we can measure the capacitor again let's get the board to cool down a little bit so then we can try it with the charger again Now the board temperature is little down. Let's try it out. Okay. Yeah, it is 20 volt. So it's look like now PD control is working fine. Okay. Yes. It is on 20 volt. So looks like we have repaired this board. Anyways, as I remember, I think I have one donor board like same model. So I will replace this capacitor with that one. See, it is the same PD controller there. This is the capacitor that we need. Okay, no shorts there. We can use this one. No, no shorts. okay <coughs> we have 20 volts in the line so the capacitor and everything seems working fine let's assemble the board and we will go for the final test Okay, the power light is turned on now. Mm, let me show you. See this area. Okay, I'm turning it on. Okay, keyboard backlit also turned on. Power button also, I can see that some red color light is there. Let's wait for a poster screen. okay so laptop is turning on also it's booting up there is no password admin okay so the repair is successful so you can see i'm gonna fully assemble the laptop so we can do our final test okay. then everything will be done
it shows 1.32 mps now with 20 volts so which means the laptop is charging okay. let's try to Okay, the laptop is booting up. It is a successful repair. If you learned something from this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much for watching us again.